Hey guys, Paulie Howard. I'm with Fox Sports Radio. It's Friday, October 16th. Before I tell you what I'm betting, time to rant and run. Congratulations to the Mets. Can you believe the Dodgers with that payroll? $289 million. They don't win a playoff series. A stat, a number you will not believe. So you got to be sitting down for this one. The last three years, the Dodgers have spent $650 million on payroll. They have one playoff series win to show for it. Bye-bye, Mattingly. Get out. That is embarrassing. Kershaw, Granke, couldn't find a number three. Yes, they had some injuries, but the, the manager made some bad decisions, and the team, horrible last night. How does a guy go from first to third on a walk? The whole team forgets to cover third base. Murphy takes advantage. Guess what? They win by a run. Ethier, way over in foul ground in right field, for whatever reason, catches that fly ball, allows a run to tag up and score. Would have been 0-2 on the batter. Horrible job by the Dodgers and Mattingly. What a tough season the last three years. Should be some major changes in Los Angeles after what happened. But congratulations to the Mets. They move on. Game one tomorrow at home against the Cubs. Cubs a $1.40 favorite in the series. It'll be Lester against Harvey. And then tonight you have the ALCS with the Blue Jays and the Royals. The Jays a $1.45 to win that series. Estrada $1.25 in game one coming up tonight so we'll have it looks like we'll have a good world series three lunatic fan bases are left royals fans get into it too and they're hungry they haven't won it since 85 even though they went to the world series last year so a lot going on there with the baseball playoffs how about stanford in college football 56 points last night they drub ucla at home since the six point loss to start the season at northwestern good team great defense 9 a.m pacific start for stanford they weren't ready 56 points, 31, 41, 42, and 55 points. The rest of the way, as we can agree, they're the best team in the Pac-12 right now. Washington, Washington State, Colorado, Oregon, Cal, and Notre Dame. That's what's left on the schedule for Stanford. Should be 11-1 going into the Pac-12 title game where they'll likely play Utah, who maybe only has a loss or could be undefeated as well. Good opportunity for Stanford. I don't know what the hell is going to happen with the playoff. Could Clemson go undefeated? We'll uh, probably get a one-loss team out of the Big Ten, maybe an undefeated team out of the Big Ten, a one-loss team out of the SEC and the Big 12. Who knows what's going to happen. But Stanford in great position, only two road games the rest of the year. Great job by Stanford and Shaw turning that around. And the Falcons finally go down. Great job out of Brees, 30-39. I didn't see that come. I didn't think he had anything left. Two big turnovers by Atlanta, deep in New Orleans territory. Saints saved their season for the time being as the Falcons go down in that one. Time to tell you what I'm betting. Two featured pro picks up at pregame.com. J.R. O'Donnell, 6-0 and so far in the NHL. He's got his NHL game of the month that goes today. Great job so far, J.R. No one works harder. You'll love his write-ups, his full analysis. A pick you must have. Looking to make it 7-0 and on the season in the NHL. Grab his game of the month today. And Steve Merrill with a... Uh, College football TV game tonight. Two-star, best bet in college football. Games on TV. Sit back, relax, get the pick. Collect your uh, winnings and go with Steve Merrill today. Two picks you must have up at pregame.com. We're on a total today also on a TV game in college football. A big move on this one, but the pros agree on this one for different reasons. They like this side. I like this pick, rather, handicapping the cappers. Paulie's pick from the pros. It's yours for just $15, a college football total today. Grab that, uncovering that hidden gem and bringing it to you every day, handicapping the cappers. Dave Koken on a good run here with the free pick. He's on Nevada, minus six in college football against god-awful Wyoming. Could be the second-worst team in college football other than uh, North Texas. That's his, read his full write-up and analysis and all the free picks up at pregame.com. Special bulk offer, $99 gets you $170 in spending power, 70% bonus. Check that out at pregame.com. Good through Monday. We'll talk to you tomorrow. Good luck out there on pregame.com.